Alrighty, everybody, it's a great day, honey buns. Let's just do an organic reading, a collective um message, and then see what uh you need to know. Take your love vitamin. Boo boo. Ooh. Don't forget that we do have the spiritual ability class um for this month right here. You can purchase it through the website. The link is down below. I'll link that information down there as well. Alrighty, let's take a look. What do you need to know? What does the collective need to know, Holy Spirit? What does a collective need to know? What does a collective... Dang. All right. Um, a situation to heal your health. First of all, be mindful of your health. This could also be like mental health, emotional health, your love. You don't be. Don't get yourself into a bitter state. Also, I just heard don't give up. I heard peekaboo. Peek Something or someone could be playing peekaboo with you. Don't give up and think that love does not exist. So love could be playing peekaboo with you, waiting for you to evolve, think better, feel better, and um even I heard act better. Um, peace offering. Uh, peace, peace, peace. Um, I don't know why I got stuck, stuck right here. Someone could want to offer you a peace offering. I hear offers, offer, O-F-F-E-R. Um, stay focused, stay focused. Whatever you're doing is working well for you. And this is the yes card. So some of you all, you could have had a question in your mind. Yes. Is this reading for me and about me? For some of you all, it definitely is a for sure. Yes. But as a peace offering coming here, you need to stay focused. I feel like you're manifesting something. You could be in an energy to where you're very loving right now. Very open because this person's um, hand is open. Oh, the manifestation, how to, okay, so you, some of you all, you, somebody is going to learn something, how to manifest and rubbing your hands and feeling energies, uh, healing properties as well. So there's some um, initiation spiritually that some of you all are going through again you're manifesting something, but something is coming to you. I also hear the word favor. Someone could want a favor. To help you have more understanding with your individual life, you need to make sure you get out in nature, just retreat to recharge, to, you know, completely be rejuvenated. Sometimes getting out in nature, connecting with the trees helps us a whole lot. So you need to recharge and keep yourself balanced out so that you don't always second guess yourself. All right, let's see. Holy Spirit, what does the collective need to know? What does the collective need to know? Yep. The nine of cups. So somebody, somebody's having a hard time. Oh, I knew it. Somebody's having a hard time asking you something. I keep hearing the word favor. Somebody wants a favor. Um, they feel awkward. I just heard awkward. Um, they don't want to come off too needy. They don't want to come off desperate, but they want something. I also hear the word safe haven. Um, the two of the ten, the nine of cups, the ten of wands, and the two of cups. This is the thing. Somebody here is coming to ask you for a favor. So this could be someone wanting to make a peace offering. Hey, will you do something for me? I really hope you can help me. I've been hoping and wishing. Um, I know, you know, things have not been the best between the two of us, but I still need to ask you something. I know you're very focused in life. Also, I want to, you know, I miss our connection. I miss our friendship. I miss our interacting. I miss being in a relationship with you. Um, I just miss the closeness, the two of cups here. This person in this two of cups is something that they, they, they need from you, need or highly want. I keep hearing safe haven. Yep, the will of fortune. This could also be someone that you know you've already given them a no. They want to change your mind. They're trying to convince you. I heard the word persuade. They're trying to persuade you. One more card here, Holy Spirit. Yep. The seven of cups and the queen of pentacles. Okay, so this is the thing. Somebody is trying to get a yes out of you. They're confused. Okay, how do I get them to say yes? I heard I hear the word agree. How do I get them to agree to doing this or agree to doing that? So this is the thing. Somebody wants you to agree to doing something. This person already feels like you're going to be like, isn't that a bit much? Or, you know, you're asking a lot of me. You know, I even heard the words, how dare? How dare you ask me that? The thing is, this person right here, I feel like somebody wants you in their life or they just highly need something from you but they don't want you to know i hear that song hold on They don't want you to know how how much they need this favor or want this favor from you. <clears throat> I don't 
don't know why I feel like somebody wants to make you like their safe haven or you feel like their safe haven, you are a safe place for them. Um, this could be someone that's trying to figure out, you know, would you just, you know, would you mind? I hear, would you mind if, you know, if I, if I came over here sometime, you know, could I just, you know, come over? What's the nine of cups? What's the nine of cups? Mm -hmm. The three of cups and the two of pentacles. So here's the thing. <clears throat> Somebody here is juggling back and forth. Okay, you know. I should invite them out. Somebody wants to ask you out. And not only ask you out, but they in, in this asking you out, they, they want a favor. Yeah, the magician card. But they're trying to find a way to, you know, get into your energy to make sure that you will give them a yes. And uh, this is somebody who want, who want a relationship with y'all. It could be relationship. It could. It could. For some of y'all, I don't really see sex here. Um, no, this is more than just sex. This is this King of Pentacles here. So this King of Pentacles, this is the thing. This this person is trying to find the right way to bring something up to you. This is like some sort of proposal, but it's 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 a it's a suggestion. They have some sort of suggestion for you and them. And the thing of the matter is they know your focus and they just want to get back close to you. Now, this could be someone that kind of has you know you separated from, not you that you've taken your focus off of, and they know that since you've taken your focus off this person that made them U-turn and like, wait a minute, why are they not calling me? You know, why are they not interested in what I'm doing? You know, I haven't heard from them. So the, the thing of the matter is um, someone here kind of put, they kind of hung themselves and now they want to, you know, they want to make a suggestion between you and them. Yep, the four of pentacles. Because see, this person holds on to this relationship more than what you know, honey. And this is someone here who could have held back from telling you, you know, yeah, I like you or I want you. But they held back saying something before. Now, they do. I told you. They, they want to talk to you, but they want to ask you for a favor. I really feel like I hear the word compromise. They're trying to find a way to get you to compromise with them, to hold on to them. I hear that song, baby, hold on to me. See, I'm a special kind. They want you to see them as being special again. So this could be someone that, you know, that you had high regards for, you know, something changed. You took your focus off of them. You don't have the same regards for them as you once did. They know that. However, they want to get you back in that head space, back in that heart space. You know, they want, they want to make you feel that way towards them again. So this is the thing. I hear that song. I don't, I don't know that song. I hear the words. This person calls you baby. They have a nickname for you already. What's the favor they want? What do they want to ask? I hear that song, You're My Lady. If you're in a relationship, somebody wants you to break up straight, straight point blank. Some of you all, this could be someone you've moved on from. They, they, they're hoping that you'll break up with someone so they can get back into your life. And that's the thing. This is someone here. They, this person definitely wants to talk to you. And they have a lot to say. What's coming out of this tower? What do they want from this tower? Others of you, there's, a, there's something they want you to realize. Their secrets. So this is someone, they're going to expose themselves. And it's not so much as exposure. They're going to reveal something about them to you. Okay, so I'm going to tell you what you want to know. I'll go, I heard, I'm going to go ahead and confirm it. All these accusations. I'm going to, you know, I'm going to put an end to this mess. Um, I hear trance. This is someone that felt like you were in a trance over them. Meaning, so this is the one who thought, someone that thought that you were stuck on them. Mm -hmm. And you could have, you could have allowed like gossip, rumors, secrets. Some of it definitely was lies to confuse you. And they knew that, but they were fine with it because it's almost like the gossip and the rumors and the confusion kept you in La La Land and stuck on them. So the, the thing of the matter is you you finally walked off and finally got tired. And like, you know what? If these secrets, if these illusions, I'm just done with this, that, and all of that. I'm going to go another way. I'm going to reroute um, my focus. So the thing is, they're going to come and ask you, you know, what if I ask you for a favor? What if I tell you these secrets in return of, me asking you for a favor. Okay, high priestess, what else? Somebody here wants sex with you. <laughs> they do. Um, for, That's the first thing I heard. The first set of you all, there's somebody who want to try to give you a reason to have sex with them. 
Period. 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 Those of y'all that don't resonate with that, this person wants you to go somewhere with them. Now, where you're going, this is this could be some sort of secret. They're going to let you in on, okay, I'm going somewhere. I heard I'm going away. I hear that song. I'm going back to Cali. 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 I'm going back to Cali. No, I don't think so. This person is going somewhere. The Knight of Wands is not just a player. The Knight of Wands is someone that's on a journey. They have something they have to find out and figure out. On this journey, this person has had a realization about their life and they're going somewhere and they want to talk to you. Will you go with me? Okay, where are they going? Child, they're going far, honey. I'm going to tell you right now. They're going somewhere. Somebody here could be going three hours away, three states away, or they could be going... um to a different country, period. Yep. And that's what it is. They want you to go with them. This is somebody they want to talk to you. They want to apologize. I heard for being an ass, for being an ass. And they were because they were nonchalant. And the king of wands that went straight to the king of swords. This is somebody here they tried to handle you. If y'all were having sex before, they thought because you sexed them one time that you know that, you know, I'm just going to be honest. They thought they had you. And I got a grocery bag. This is somebody who they knew they rocked your bed. They knew you liked their sex. They knew you liked the way they made you climax, period. I can make your bed rock. Now, this person has more um, thoughts about you than what you realize. Thoughts, feelings, and emotions. And the thing of the matter, they've been nonchalant. But this is someone here that's also been bit very discreet about their moves because they are... Someone here could just all together be moving. They are... Yes, the heck they are, honey. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute, honey. Show me that again. Yep, they are. They're moving away from some people from their past. Uh-huh. This is a single person. And this is someone here that definitely, this could be a woman too that's moving away from someone um, or getting away from somebody they used to be. I heard abusive, an abusive relationship connection or something like that. But they are leaving someone from a toxic person in the past, this emperor here. They could have, you know, um, have known this person for quite some time. But this person is ditching a lot of people. So that's what it is. One or two things. This person is moving away. And some of you all, they are. They're moving. And they want you to go with them. Some Second of you all, this is someone who kind of wants like, Because I like a honeycomb hideout. A honeycomb hideout is when, you know... Like when I go home, my hometown, I have a honey, honeycomb hideout. Nobody knows where this person lives, um, and that's where I am. Um, you can ride by their place. You can't see my vehicle, but I'm inside their house. That's my honeycomb hideout. You know what I'm saying? So that's what it is. That's what somebody wants from you. You know, can I please come over sometime? I just need to get away. I just need to get, you know, I, I hear you're like a breath of fresh air to this person. They want a huge favor. It's not now somebody here. I don't see any jail energy. I want to, I want to say this, make sure you're not harboring a fugitive. But what I am saying is, um, this person right here needs a getaway and they, they want to ask you, will you help me get away? Um, also, will you help me, you know, sort things out, get my head back in the game, get things back right because I've been lost for a while. And they've been indecisive on how to ask you because they don't want you to feel like they're using you. Now, some of you all, this could be a friend, you know, that, that just needs some help. Others of you, this is someone that has some sort of feelings for you, their lover's card here. And they want to, you know, not only apologize, but suggest something to you. Why don't you come with me? Let's do it together. Let, I heard start over. They want to start over together. So there's a move that's taking place here. Somebody wants you to move with them. And secondly, the others of you, they they um they may need a, you know, they want to come by. Like, you know, can I have a key to your place? May I come over? I hear can we I hear that song, yeah. Can I come over? Can I come over? I think that's Aaliyah. They want to be able to access your home. And I heard this this could be for some of y'all. This person already had access to your house. They already had access to your house, to your home, and they messed it up. You took your key back. Because I just heard somebody say, can I get my key back? They, 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 it's, it's, they want to make your, your place is like a breath of fresh air. It's a safe haven for them. You're the, oh my God. Why did I not see that before? You're their strong tower. You are their secret. You're my little secret. And that's how we should keep it. What's that song? 21 Savage? I'm going to look it up, link it. They don't, okay, so it's like this. Nobody knows who you are. Nobody knows where you live but them. Can I just come over? May I just lay my head over here? Can I just rest up? Can I just take a nap? 
You know, can I take a shower? Can I take a bath? May I please just have some food? You know, can you help me out? I'm not asking much. But they, they do. They this it's like this, they want to give you something to help to help you help them. Like, can I come over sometime? You know, I can give you some money on the bills, the grocery. I'm not gonna bother you. I just wanna be there with you. It's so peaceful over there. You hold a peace that you don't realize. And see, I'm trying not to go spiritual. This is this is make sure we can real long. This person wants you to lay their peace on them. Give me this. What I told you. They do. This person want to come come to your house, but but they they this person right here don't have peace in their life. They're bothered, they're frustrated. They could be dealing with someone that's really aggravating the hell out of them, or they could be dealing with someone that has a lot of evil in them, and that they want to get away from this person. This person wants to come to you because they regard you as a friend. Some of you all this may be a relationship. Others of you all this is your friend. This is uh, someone you you you. I hear G code. See that's that's personal. Y'all are G coded. Y'all are privately coded. You know people may think they know y'all, but they don't. Y'all are the kind of oh God, I love this. Y'all are the kind of people y'all intentionally confused outsiders but y'all are in locked in y'all locked in coded by a certain thing i'm not gonna go into that because that's for friends you know even if it is a relationship this is somebody here that you know you arrive with them and they know you arrive with them and the thing is they want to build their truth to you but the, the truth of the matter is some of them may want you to move away or move with them others of you they want to come to your house when they can get away can i can i come over now if you somebody mistress you know you already know what time it is they want to come over they want to get me from this, this, this hell in over here. Whatever that is. I'm just saying. You know if you're a mistress or not. Because the, the high priestess does represent a mistress. She can be a mistress or a mister. They want to come over. And they want to say, you know, can I just come over here on the weekends, man? I don't want to be there. Somebody want to be somewhere. But they want to be over there with you. I'm done with that. I'm done with that. Your house is a safe place. Others of you. And I also see a situation here. I ain't going to lie. This person been adding your money up. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. They been adding your money up, honey. Mm -hmm. They adding your money up and their money up. Me and you. I hear stay down. Stay down 10 toes. If you just rock with me through this rough place, I promise you I got you. And I hear somebody saying, I know you do. You know this person got you. Somebody got a situation. They got some shit complicated. All right, I'm, I'm gonna link that song, that video by Neo. They want you to stay down with them 10 toes. Help them through this rough patch because they're going through a rough patch. And they adding your money up like, you know, we can put our money together and we can get this. Let's go away. Let's move away. Let's move three states away. Let's go to a new country. Let's start over. Damn. Shit. All right. Close this out for me. Let me see. Yep. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. To this queen of wands, this could be a woman that has this idea. This woman wants some help. Wants some help. Oh, I need some help. And this is someone they've been in and out, in and out. And the thing that matters, I'm going to tell you. Okay, so the Knight of Wands can also represent, you know, in and out energy. They may not be able to be there every day. Somebody's also trying to stage something elsewhere. And they're playing dodgeball, dodgeball, but they want to be like, baby, if you just help me. Some some people, they call you baby. Other like, friend, come on, man, homegirl, homeboy, look, you know what I'm about. Man, I'm just letting me, just help me fool them, trick them. I promise you I got you because I got this going on down here. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Just rock with me. Ride with me. Roll with me. That's the thing. And this is someone here. Somebody here is an investor, just so you know. So y'all know if y'all dealing with an investor or something like that. That is her. Somebody here is an investor. If you allow them to invest in you and your energy and your home, they're, you're going to get a great return. That's their plan for you. Yep. This is someone here who is definitely going to cross the world. Somebody who's going to relocate abroad. And this person right here, yeah, they do. Somebody here could, the Nine of Pentacles going straight to the Ten of Pentacles. This person right here could want to like come to your house on a regular, on a regular and, and some of you all, they want to like move away with you. Your house and a house, a trailer, an apartment, a condo, somewhere. But yeah, so for this this person here want to they 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 want you. You're their safe haven. They could be also adding your money up, saying let's put our money together. Let's get, let's go half on a house. You know, let's go have, let's go half on a place together, me and you. Until we get this money together, man, just help me. Let can I come over here? I don't want to be over there. My mom is really getting my nerves. Somebody may still sit with their mom, or like a family member. There's, some, there's something about this heavy emphasis on a residence here. Heavy, 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 heavy emphasis. Heavy, heavy, heavy 
um, this um, on a residence. Yeah, this person wants somewhere, wants somewhere to stay with you, honey. All right, let's see. Your yeah, prosperity. Somebody may have a hold on some money or something like that. The frogs represent prosperity. So they're asking you, if you just help me out through this little rough place, this little rough patch, you know I got you. When I get my income tax, I'm going to get you back. You can buy one of my kids. I just heard that. Or I'm expecting this refund from such and such. I promise I got you back. Independence. This person is very independent. They're not a kind of person to kind of hustle you. I don't see any hustling moves. It's just someone who needs someone to lay their head sometimes. Or... You know, I just gotta, I gotta be honest, y'all. Now, so here, don't get mad at me for saying, "Well, hey, yeah, why you say that?" Hey, I got, I got to the truth because somebody here, they might, you know, you know, they want to, you know, ah, man, listen, they want to come over to this high priest's house, whether you're a mistress or not, and you're their strong tower, and they feel safe with you. They feel safe with their secrets. Their truth is sacred with you. And they, they, they're safe. They're safe. It's safe with you. So whether you're just a high priestess or, a, you know, a mistress, they want to have open access to come there. I ain't calling nobody a mistress or a mister. I'm just saying, whoever you are, this, this high profile secret person. I'm going to kind of close this out. Oh, yeah. This person got a trick up their sleeve. And they're going to tell you about it. Mm -hmm. And it as it, this ain't gonna take long. Um, I see a little plan here. This ain't gonna take long at all. Um, other people are in on this plan. Like I heard two. It could be two other people that know about this plan. And this per this, this plan this, this plan is to get away. Hey, let's get away. Let's get a room on the other side of town. They wanna get away, honey. Yep. This higher calling. Something is calling them. I heard something keeps calling me. They feel drawn back to you for this help. This person need a big favor. They, they they probably could get it from, you know, someone else, but they feel like you are their high priestess. You know, yeah. Them songs on the link is going to make sense. That 21 Savage song, yeah. All right, somebody here with some big glasses too. Okay, um, I, you know, I ain't picking at nobody glasses though. Virgo, Aquarius, Virgo. Scorpio and Pisces. Um, anything else? Nah, I'm leave it there. Peace and blessing, great day. Listen to the links down below. It'll help you understand. This is somebody who needs a big favor, needs and or wants a big favor because they about the tricks, they about to pull a move. They about to pull a move. All right, great day. They need a favor from you. Can they stay over there for a couple of days? <laughs> Namaste. <laughs>